I have no idea what you were saying about the brakes. Okay, so if you put a 20 inch wheel in a fork that's meant for a 26 inch wheel, see how there's all this extra yeah, space yeah. up here? Um, normally, the, the brake posts, these things where the brake ma brakes mount, or brake boss is the other term for these, I think. Um, these are located so that the brake pads wind up here, which is a great place if there's a 26 inch wheel that would hit the rim perfectly. Oh. But with a 20 inch wheel, the rim's down here. So what I've done on the other side here is instead of a cantilever or V-brake where the brake pad is above the post, I've used a U-brake, which is an old, mostly obsolete technology where the brake pad is below the post. And it was actually not quite far enough below with the original brake pads, but switching to a V-brake pad gave me just a little bit of extra space there. Um, and it worked nicely. Also, you can um, clamp a brake lever onto a fork if you need to, if the fork's the right diameter. It seems like on older mountain bike forks, this spot a little below the brake post is usually the 22-2 diameter that you need for anything that would clamp to a handlebar. So that's kind of neat too.